All right, guys, today at the range, we've got the 300 blackout with a sight mark wraith on. Uh, yesterday, I sighted this in for 208 grain subsonics, much like the Hornady Black, because this is Hornady ammo with the 208 grain projectile that they use. We're going to check the elevation difference between supersonics and subsonics. Uh, the supersonics are 115 grain burger hollow points. Going to check the elevation. Uh, don't know if there's going to be any left or right, but uh, I put the dot down low. We're going to aim at the dot in both shots. And then uh, check out the elevation. Don't know if there, like I say, don't know if there'll be any left or right because of rate of twist, uh, uh, speed of bullet, and all that. But that's what we're here to find out today, so stay tuned. So, first off, I'm going to put the 115 burgers in. I'm going to put three in. That means they'll be shot last. And then I'm going to put three of the 208 grain. That would basically be your horny black ammo. Now, don't make fun of me about my little snag. Uh, this pistol, stock, whatever you want to call it. The 30 round mags hit right here, so that's why I'm going with my girly mag right there. Let's check it out. Alright, here we go. I'm going to pop off some subsonics first. Uh, cold bore may be a little different. Alright, there's three subs aiming at the same spot. Here comes some supers. I'm hitting wood. I'm going to adjust to the bottom of the target. Go down and see what we got. Check it out. Got two right there, one right there, subsonics. Got one up here, super. I believe I was hitting somewhere here with the uh, supersonics. So, first two shots I didn't hit still, so I, I started aiming at the very bottom of the steel. So, it looks like about 17 inches is going to be about your difference between your supers and subs on your elevation. Thanks for watching.